Yo, what's up, show boy fell here. Welcome back to Crusaders Quest. Today we are gonna be taking a look at the, well, my choice of a top ten warriors of all time, all time. So this includes collaboration heroes. So yeah, coming in at top number number ten, last place. It is the Star Devourer, Pius. I just really love his animation and his uh, uh, art. Real nice. He's got a big, big axe. Which he pushes around and throws like a uh, disc of. I guess the stars? So yeah, really cool. Really nice animation. So yeah, he is number 10. So let's have a look at his illustration real quick so yeah easy solo for the uh, last stage so yeah real nice so he's like half dragon or full dragon yeah really nice really love the coloring and his, his uh, weapon is so cool massive axe or hammer all right coming down at the number ninth place who could it be it is Aris. I really love Aris when he came out, man. So good. This animation is really nice, too. He rides the chariot and summons a Spartan warrior. Oh, he just killed that last boss real fast, man. Crazy. So, yeah, he is really strong, too. Yeah, really cool animation. And his uh, illustration is not too bad, either. It's actually, yeah, quite decent. Very cool. Very nice armor and a weapon as well. So yeah, real nice, proper warrior. So yeah, all right. Let's have a look at number eight. Who is number eight? And coming in at number eight is it is actually the newest, one of the newest last hero. It is Tian Mo, Kutsugachi Tian Mo. Yeah, her animation man is really good, and yeah, she's super strong. So she basically hides, uh, rides her uh, <laughs> weapon as a skateboard and shoots flying daggers. Look at that, six seconds for that last um, episode. Really strong. Uh, her her illustrations, uh, it's all right. It's okay. Like she's uh, resurrection as a young lady, so it's okay. Would have been cooler, but it's alright. And coming in at number seven, who could it be? It is Twilly. So it's not a uh, Eve. It's actually Twilly. So Twilly of the final battle. I really like her. Uh, yeah, animation. Really cool weapon. And you get different stances. She's got the flag to rally her soldiers and yeah that forward thrust of her great sword really cool come on get him boom so yeah that's twilly coming at number seven and yeah her illustration is real nice too really love the armor i thought she was gonna be a um guardian but yeah turns out she is a warrior so yeah, this is Sun Sun's favorite hero ever, ever, ever. So yeah, really cool, great sword, and yeah, armor. Real nice illustration, man, real nice. All right, coming in at number six. Who is number six? It is Sasha, the Fire Witch. And I did get her the skin, really cool skin. It's got burning uh, torch, two of them, actually. But yeah, she's someone's meteor fire meteor so you are really good look at that and yeah really nice animation awesome weapon she is one of the OG ones old school you know one of the witches fire witch and yeah her illustration is not too bad either but yeah this skin's really nice though really nice so yeah one of the OG respect the OG real nice all right, let's move on to the top five. So who came in at number five? It is Izuna, 
really cool animation for the weapon. It's got the long sword and then the after effect because she is too fast. So Izuna the Vigilante. Look at that. Boom. Very cool, man. When she first came out, her dash is so fast and yeah, really far. So yeah, really, really good. One of my favorite heroes of all time, for sure. And yeah, her illustration is really nice too. It's got really long blue hair. And yeah, long sword. Katana Yusa. Very nice. Alright, coming in at number four. Who could it be? It's none other than the Queen of the Whales. It is Mare. The ocean's beloved. Her animation is really cool too. She uh, yeah summons the big ass whale and rides it around, and summons a humpback whale as well. Humpback whale? I think that's how you say it. That does tons of damage. Let's go. Oh no! Come on! So it's uh, orca killer whale. And yeah, this skin's really cool too. <laughs> Little water coming out of her head, <laughs> and she's got the yeah, white whale as a weapon. So yeah, real nice. So yeah, I think number four. It's a good place for her. And the top three, oh, her illustration, of course. Let's have a look. Real nice, real clean illustration for her, actually. It's actually, yeah, really nice. Like the uh, art department is, yeah, on point. And of course, the top three coming in at number three, who could it be? It is none other than Rael. So she is a limited time or hidden hero. So, really, really, uh, Worth it to uh, grind. So yeah, her her great sword and animation really cool, man. So she summons like uh, rose and thorns as well, which actually stuns enemies. So she is more of a tank as well, but yeah, really good. But real nice. Oh, got a hidden one as well. But he died so fast, and as a final boss. But yeah, she's not built for PBE, but yeah, very very nice. That's why I got the uh, Zahad in this um, team so she can just pull him forward but yeah she takes damage and of course yeah really cool animation so yeah top three so number three who could it be the number two Ooh. let's have a look at her illustration real quick so her illustrations yeah really nice so i did i didn't flip her last time but yeah let's flip her this time Coming in at number three, so yeah, not too bad. Didn't make it to the top spot, but I mean, I think number two or number one is gonna be. Ooh. All right, let's have a look at the top two. So coming in at number two, it is actually a collaboration hero. So very limited time hero, and of course none other than Biken. I think from the Guilty Gear collaboration. So yeah, really cool. Real cool animation. Um, really strong too. And I got her skin of this one to have a black, black hair. Blue armor. But yeah, very nice. And of course her illustration is just on point, man. Real nice. Probably one of my favorite illustrations. Really, really good. And of course, she is a collab hero. Otherworld Bakken. So yeah, real nice. Look at that, man. So nice. Like, yeah, the art for this one is just on point. So she is a samurai as well. Very, very nice. And of course, the number one warrior of all time. All time. Top, top warrior. He is also very limited time collaboration hero. None other than guts from berserk so yeah really good really strong i reckon we're probably one of the strongest collaboration heroes so yeah her um his his attacks is just crazy man. boom so every third attack auto attack she like fires a cannon and just does, does tons of damage and of course really cool great sword you know the iconic great sword that he's got and yeah illustration's not too bad and yeah, he just destroys any game mode, man. Like, even in Colosseum. So we'll have a look at Colosseum real quick. We'll just pick whatever. Uh, I think this guy doesn't have our 
Yeah, this guy's got Rolando. But yeah, he's just... Even his auto attack's really strong. So like every third hit. Sometimes you don't even reach the third hit and yeah, the enemies are already dead. Because yeah, his auto, auto attack's just next level. As to be expected. There we go. Whoa, yeah, I didn't make it to that explosion. So yeah, real nice. So yeah, let us know what your uh, top 10 is in the comment, captains. Um, yeah, see if I uh, don't have any other ones. I think Tramontana would be cool and Dempsey, but I didn't get him till later on. Or I'm still trying to farm for him, so unfortunate. Really cool illustration too for uh, Guts. But yeah, thanks so much for watching. Thank you so much for your unyielding support as always. And welcome to all the brand new subscribers. Thank you guys. Really appreciate it. And yeah, if you haven't yet, subscribe for more. If you guys like this video, give us a feedback. And we might do more for the other classes as well. But yeah, those are my top 10. I shall see you all next time. Stay safe and good luck on your posts. Have a good day, guys. See you all next time. Bye-bye. Mm,